Uh, no, it's not really clearing out, and uh, let's be honest, I'm not standing in it here. I'm standing very close to it, but look how big this thing is. I mean, it looks like a little lake here in the uh, parking lot of the uh, Zane Plaza here on Bridge Street in Chillicothe. You know, I was never really good at skimming stones. Let's see if we can get one to get one to bounce. Oh, there, that was a nice little bounce there. Here's, let's try another one there. Ah, that one went just right down to the bottom. Take a look at some video from earlier. You can see uh, what uh, folks had to deal with in this parking lot. We're right behind the Arby's here, and folks are uh, still going through this job giant puddle here trying to get to the drive through Nobody's really having any trouble, especially if they are in uh, larger, uh, high-profile and high-clearance vehicles. Of course, you know, uh, the uh, safety officials always say, don't go through water if you don't know the depth of it. You really run the risk of stalling your car or being swept away. Probably not much chance of being swept away here. Stalling is a possibility, though. I would estimate maybe it's about five, six uh, inches at the uh, bottom here. Let's see if we can get another one. I got a nice little flat one here. Let's see if we can get this one. To... Oh, that was ridiculous. Gosh, I'm embarrassing myself here. Nah, that one's not going to go either. Really, the only big problem we are seeing here in Chillicothe, and right now the sun is shining, and uh, not much evidence except for this giant puddle of all that rain we had just a little while ago. Reporting live in Chillicothe, I'm Tom Bosco, ABC 6 News. I love it, Tom. I'll let you get back to practicing there. Just speak to the <laughs> amount of rain that's fallen in Ross County today.